Hello everyone, so I'll try to make this very short and sweet. So before I was trying to record my generated frames from lossless scaling and I went online and checked what I had to do in the OBS to be able to record the generated frames. I came here, created a game capture, tried to record the generated, the generated frames that way, but every time I tried it was just a black screen, no matter what I had to do, black screen always. So. I tried, I tried, I tried, I, and I failed, and eventually I just, okay, let's try to use the AMD Relief software that you can use to record your gameplay. So, I was trying before like this, to capture a specific window, lossless scaling administrator, and this should be enough from what I see to for the majority of users. I went online, YouTube videos, Reddit, all the time this would be enough and in my case it would not work and I can show you if I hit Control alt s the view for me it's maximized it's using lossless scaling but as you can see it only shows the display capture once again this one this new source here doesn't show anything and it should show something so this was not working for for me so what I did was I came to MD, the MD software, the Adrenaline software, and then I just came here and I had to update actually because my version was a previous version who had no option to record and stream, I don't know why, because I had another much older version and, it, and this was there, so I don't know. I had to update my driver, so if, if it doesn't appear to you, try updating your drivers. So, I tried coming here, coming to full screen and uh, enable this option to record the desktop, starting recording and then going in-game to record my game. What happened was like a, a mess of stuttery frames, nothing was working properly. So I tried it once again without the recording desktop, went to the game, also a mess. So I found a solution for this actually just going to keep in mind which sh what is your shortcut for the recording in my case if i go here to settings hotkeys the recording shortcut is control shift e but i'll give you also another way to do this yeah don't do anything here in the software itself just go to in my case i'll go to the shed ps4 instance because this is what i've been using to to test out my lossless frame generation um, and I'm just going to open the game and you can see on top the normal frames that I have which are now locked to 40 fps I'm just going to full screen the page and then continue and go in game and yeah what you need to do is once you are in the game you're going to hit the shortcut for the lossless scaling. In my, in my case, it's Control Alt S. And now for me, it's showing the generated frames. But because I'm using OBS to record this video, it's not showing to you. But now, very simply, you, ju you just hit Alt Z. And then a sidebar from AMD will appear where you can start the recording. It will appear and then make sure you are not using the record desk desktop because for me it was failing so you, you just start recording and then you alt z back to make the sidebar disappear and it should be working you are now recording your generated frames with amd relief so now i'll stop the recording hitting the hot key to stop the recording which is Control shift e I will control alt s to disable the lossless scaling and then I will show you the resulting video it's here videos no not not in this case it's in your videos folder and then read on relieve and in my case it is unknown and in your case it's, it should also display unknown and here my default video player is actually Media Player Classic, but I won't use this one. I'll use 
VLC. So I'll just right click this one and open with VLC. And now you'll be able to see that we recorded the frames at at least 60. Yeah, you can see 40, which is being generated to 80. And the game itself will show to you at 60 FPS, which is the limit of YouTube. But yeah, very simple. Just I know using Relive is not the best option and you want to use OBS, but in my case, OBS was not working. And if you are seeing this video, it's because it's not working for you as well. So yeah, give AMD Relive a try and do let me know if it works for you. So if you want any more tips, just like, subscribe to the channel and yeah, have a nice day.